This is an old gem that has stuck with me since I watched it. It's such a nice film that has a kind of charm that stays with us because it has aged wonderfully. In a nutshell, this is a movie about two gentlemen, Wally the playwright and, of course, Andre, the theatre director. We see them chat over dinner. That's it. It's just two friends catching up after not seeing each other for so long. Andre delves into his life of traveling, the people he met, connecting with people, and sharing his philosophy. Andre delivers his stories with so much enthusiasm and energy that it uplifts you. Sometimes it's comical. In some places, Wally and Andre have a civil debate over other topics, which is quite interesting. And then the movie ends when they part ways and continue to go about their own lives. Overall, I think it can be summed up that it's about a yearning for human connection. I won't spoil it for you by mentioning everything they talk about, but it is quite thought-provoking. The movie is nearly two hours long, but it doesn't feel that way. The time passes by so quickly. The dialogue is so well written and well acted, you feel as if you are actually there with them. It feels so natural. It keeps you interested from start to finish. It's a reminder of what a conversation is supposed to be. There are times when we need to take time out of our routines and so that we can open ourselves up to our friends to escape from the obligations. Sometimes all we need is a friend to have a chat with, to challenge us and to relax with, to share moments of joy with. This movie is a refreshing reminder of that liberating feeling when you are having a good time with your friends. It doesn't have to be about doom and gloom. After all, there's more to life than that. When you have a face-to-face -face conversation with someone, you have each other's full attention. They can be open with you, sharing with you their thoughts, their beliefs, what they are going through, and more. There is no judgment, no arguing, no emotional knee-jerk reactions. It's just simple exchange of ideas and thoughts between two friends. It's nice. This movie is one of the reasons I stopped watching television. When you break out of the spell coming out of that screen, you begin to see the world with your own eyes and come to your own conclusions. You see the world differently. You see reality as it is right in front of you. This is another one of those movies that is about friendship and love. A desire to connect with others so that we can make the world a better place. Every time I watch this movie, I feel uplifted, ready to see the world with new eyes, with more empathy and an open mind. It makes me more keen to go out and meet people, hoping to have conversations like this with them, to connect with people. So, my overall verdict for this film? Watch it. I highly recommend it. Thank you for watching. Take good care of yourselves.